hi guys welcome back to my channel so on this vlog i will show you my 200 290 um shared apartment here in tokyo um yeah let's get to it so this is basically the building which is like a two-story and when you walk to the front door this is the mailbox maybe you have a mail you can pick up your mail from here and then this is an intercom maybe you have a guest or a delivery they can call your room number and then you come in and as asia demands you keep your shoes by the entrance you don't wear your shoes inside so here is where we keep our shoes and yes so next you can keep your meals maybe you're not around someone can pick it up and drop it for you here there is security there is camera also and here we have two washing machines and two dryer which is very good so you don't have to bother about where to spread your clothes or anything this is a vacuumer so ground floor here we have like um five rooms yes ground floor and um i'm staying upstairs so let's go and then on the um second floor which is where i stay we have we also have five rooms i think yes five rooms yes we do have five rooms and this is a quick tour of the kitchen what the kitchen looks like i mean the house was very very conducive and comfortable for me while i was there they have um rice cooker microwave and also they supply all these amenities every week every week they, you get a new one you know so you don't have to bother about anything that has to do with the kitchen you just have to um get what you want to eat they supply this there is pots there is frying pan there is basically everything there is spoon you know this is a ventilator while cooking of course so i mean the house was very very comfortable and be relaxed for me i have no issues while i was staying there so yeah let's go together by the way yes this is what the bathroom looks like i think it's not wide enough but it's okay then we have an ac by the walkway and um here you can brush your teeth or maybe you want to look at yourself at the mirror yes a mini sink um and a mirror so when you walk from the stairs right when you walk from the stairs next is the toilet so this is the toilet what it actually looks like again it's not big but at least it's doing the work so that's okay so this is what the toilet actually looks like it's always cleaned every week i think twice in a week yes they have cleaners that do come every week to clean the whole building you just have to clean your room and trash your um trash like trash your garbage or whatever so but the building someone comes to clean it up so you don't have to worry about that okay next is my room okay so this is my room and we have this fridge that served me really well while i was here um it's messed up but it's really gave me what i wanted so this is the fridge and next is a mini hanger where you can hang your clothes and maybe if you have a few things like shoes you can keep it up and then here is where you receive your intercalls and yeah that says you can see who is calling you then the lights next is my mini bed this bed gave me back pain <laughs> but the good thing is if you have your own bed you can actually tell them oh i have my own bed and you can see this is the ac and then the window so if you have your own bed you can let them know you can change the bed bring your own and then they will talk out there so yeah that's not an issue and oh here's my yes 
one thing about this neighborhood is it's very calm it's somewhere in tokyo it's very calm it's very conducive you have no issues with anybody but if there is a possibility you can't see foreigner even if you see foreigner it will be once in a blue moon which is once in a while basically and um next i have like a reading lamp kind of a thing yes which i only used the first week i arrived because i had no idea i can actually turn um turn off and um lower my um light with the remote which is here and then we have a mini tv that i never used <laughs> yes and then we have a mini storage okay and here also we have a storage yes and then a table maybe you want to eat or uh, something you want to drink you and just keep it up and yeah i mean when i was staying in this house it was very comfortable for me i have no issues with anybody i have no issues with the agency when i signed the contract it was very easy for me they had english translator and i barely know my neighbors <laughs> yes that's to tell you how reserved it is like when i when you hear shared house it's not like everything is like shared or open or something you still have your own privacy so i'm so glad i managed to stay here and saved up and moved and if you're a person that is arriving in japan and maybe you want to stay in the town i think this is not actually a bad option right because it will give you actually what you want you don't have to pay light bill water bill all those things are inside the money the key money you're paying there's no key money actually the monthly money you're paying you know all this money are inclusive so you don't need to pay separate water bills separate um light bills separate um gas bill everything is inclusive so and you don't need to pay any key money you just have to pay your monthly rent and then you move in so if you're coming in and you don't have any property and you're worried do not worry Gigi has got you covered <laughs>